Hey Infinity Fam, welcome back to my vlog channel and I'm actually about to start packing for a trip to Santa Barbara and Morro Bay. I'm super excited, of course I'll be vlogging. I'm really excited to be getting back in the swing of things I've been, as I've been saying, but before I start packing, I wanted to go ahead and do a quick little try on haul for this channel. Now, I normally do my try on hauls on my other channel, but I really wanted to show you guys some of the cute clothes I got from Princess Polly. I absolutely love their clothes, and they wanted to partner with me again after my previous video on Infinitely Cindy, so super, super excited. Um, you can use the code CINDY20 for 20% off your orders at princesspolly.com. And two other quick things about Princess Polly is they offer free three to four day shipping with the United States with orders over $50 and they do have the option of after pay on their site as well. But I'm really excited to show you some stuff, especially since there's some UCLA stuff now with one of their newest collections, which I'm so excited about because you guys know I'm still a diehard brune. Like, that's never gonna change. So I literally graduated three years ago and I'm still rocking UCLA gear, best believe. So with that, let's go ahead and get started with this try on haul. So the first thing, I'm actually wearing it and it is this super, super cute, like small spaghetti strap top with like ruffles. It's super, super thick, which I love. It's so hard to find white items that aren't see-through. And so far, every single little thing that I've gotten from Princess Polly that are white have never been see-through, which thank goodness, because a lot of other places, it'll be see-through and I'm not about that life. So anyways, it's a really cute top with like two like little spaghetti straps here. And then it has like these ruffles on the front and on the back and these cute little like twisty ties at the bottom. And again, just super, super like thick material, which I love. And it is stretchy, but this fits me perfectly. Like I have a lot of room to move, but I wouldn't go a size smaller or a size larger. So definitely true to size for me, which is a size four. And I like how you can style this top really casually with like a pair of shorts or like you can kind of dress it up with like jeans and heels. So definitely a really versatile top. And again, I just don't have a lot of white tops because they're see-through. All right, the next thing I got, which you saw with me wearing with this top are these gray shorts. I got them a size bigger, so I got them in a size six. Again, normally I'm a four, but I wanted a bigger oversized look uh, for these shorts since it's kind of like the style, the trend, but it's kind of like this cool, not waffle knit, but kind of, I don't want to describe this, but it's just checkered, but like cool. Um, really nice material, thick, super, super stretchy. Again, you can dress this up with like, a crop top and some heels or you can really style it casually or just use these for lounging around so i love like the versatility of these so got these next thing i got is this gorgeous gorgeous dress and it's this like marble blush pinky peach color um that's long sleeve and has again the same like ruffled um scrunched detailing on both sides with like little twisty ties at the end it's so 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 cute i actually have a sleeveless version of it oh, right here in green and I got this in a size 2 since all the reviews were saying to size down in this so this one is actually a size 2 but it's too it's a smidge too small for, like I should have gotten the 4 but this is a brand new style so there weren't any reviews yet uh, for me to like base the sizing off but this is like definitely true to size um, so if you're a 4 get a 4 but they got they have this and they have this version in a short sleeve and then they also have a blue like tie-dye uh blushy or tie-dye um ombre effect um in this blush color and in blue so I, I was very torn on which one to get but i felt like this one felt like more like a marbled look which is kind of unique the next item i got was a white um ribbed bodycon dress again super thick not see-through i want a basic white dress so i can style it with like a jean jacket or um various like different coats so 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 thick the material is very very high quality and it's very comfortable also true to size just a simple bodycon dress just a basic staple piece i feel like so earlier when i was showing you the shorts and i mentioned how you could like dress it up i was thinking with this particular to uh crop top it's a crop top that's black that has like two uh, straps to one side. It's kind of funky, but I really like that it's unique. Like, it's just like, whoa, it's like a, a basic simple piece, but like with a twist. So I really, really like that. You can style this with like jeans or here you can see I'm styling it with their shorts. I wear this and like you can do like some earrings and then like, like some hoop earrings with like some black heels, like black mules that like stiletto pumps but like i think that'd be super like cute casual look um i think this is such a unique basic top 
uh, really stretchy ribbed material real nice all right now we're gonna move on to the two UCLA pieces I wanted another one but they were sold out already they sold out so quickly of a sweatshirt I wanted but it's okay because I got my hands on a crop top which looks like this it's like vintage I really like the design that Princess Polly did with for the UCLA collection is that like it's not just like the basic UCLA because I have one of those UCLA sweatshirts like I like that it's unique it's it's UCLA but like with some design that's like kind of vintage so this really oversized crop top super super cute and again I stay rocking all the brune stuff even after I've graduated and then the second UCLA item I got is this tee. Now everything in this collection on Princess Polly for the UCLA collection is oversized. So you definitely want to stick to the size you want or even a size down. So this is a small and it's very, very oversized on me. Again, a small, but it is oversized. Um, not like a collegiate fit where a small would be like skin tight for me. But I like that I could pair this with the yeah, shorts, keep it casual, baggy tee, could sleep in it. But I could also do like tie it up or I could crop it and wear it with like a denim skirt and the last clothing piece I got is a jean jacket so this is a cropped kind of like a medium washed um jean jacket really nice material it's breathable it's not too thick since and I like that since it's cropped like for my longer uh denim jackets I like it to be thicker so I can feel more warm in the winter time but when it's cropped like this of course I'm going to be wearing it you know more in the spring and summertime so I like that it's thin and breathable but like I mean I don't want to say thin, but like it's not as heavy duty. That's yeah, that's it's not heavy duty like some other jean jackets, but it's not like thin. It's normal denim material, but just cropped again. Seeing me pair it with a dress or with like a casual outfit like this crop top and the gray shorts that have been featured throughout this whole video. And then lastly, I got three little like accessories that I wanted to show you. So first was this tie-dye packet. So I'm going to tie-dye, I think one of the UCLA shirts. I think it would just be so fun to add a little pop of tie-dye or something else I own. I don't know. We'll see. But I mean, during during this time, it's great to have something to do. So and I've never ever tied any tie-dyed anything before. So I can't wait to use this. And then next, I got this super cute little car holder. Um, it's like a black leather but like vegan leather with like a puff chevron material and then a little plus charm here there are there's one main pocket up here that's magnetic so probably for like coins or keys or something and then two pockets on the back and two pockets in the front so uh, i really wanted this piece for just when i wanted to go somewhere quickly and just wanted to grab this and the very last thing i got is just this velvet pink scrunchie i mean nothing too special but i mean hey it's just an accessory a cute accessory so all right, everyone, and that's it for this try and haul on my vlog channel. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed, and if you did really like this and wanted to see more content like this, you can check out my other channel, Infinitely Cindy, that has all my other try and hauls, including my most recent one from Princess Polly. I'll have everything linked down below and at the end of the video if you want to check it out. But, all right, I gotta get to packing because this trip is tomorrow. Last minute packing, yay! Definitely gonna bring, definitely gonna bring the sheen jacket and some probably some of the UCLA stuff. Gotta rock it, gotta get those cute hiking photos, you know, with the UCLA apparel. Right, thank you all so much for watching, and I will talk to y'all in a future vlog. See you soon. Bye!